So I just came out of an EV servicing at Hyundai. I take my car servicing every three to four months, depending on how oh how much I've driven. It's usually recommended in about four thousand kilometers. At least that's what Hyundai recommends me, and that's honestly what I do. So every year I take the car about three or four times, usually four times a year. And there's this whole talk that when you drive an EV, you do not need to service it. You do need to service it. You just don't need to change too many parts in it. This car doesn't have any mobile, air filter, and all of that. And so you really don't need to worry about that. But you do need to take it for like frequent servicing just to make sure the car is doing okay. Primarily because you know the state of our roads. They're very bumpy, not pitched, not smooth, uneven. And clearance does touch here and there. And so how the servicing goes is basically I call them up when it's time to book a slot. I arrive there at the specified time and then the car is put in the line. It's usually started with some sort of visual inspection of like tire alignments, how much underbody damage there is, if anything looks wrong visually on the engine bay in front. And then after that, it's basically what sort of servicing is required and in a general servicing that's what I do it's basically they plug the car into a computer a tablet and the software runs multiple tests on like the battery like minimum ranges and maximum ranges of battery voltages and then there is the temperature thresholds like min and max temperature thresholds battery health basically when bought your battery is at a hundred percent state of health and then as you begin to use it and like charge it whether you have good charging habits or bad charging habits battery degradation is then measured and all of this is done on a tablet in a minute or two then the car is sent for washing an exterior wash followed by an interior wash and that is basically it in terms of how all of this works out and so my slot was at 9 a.m. today I needed to do a tire rotation my cars traveled like 43,000 kilometers and so it was just a swap of the front wheels to the back and the back wheels to the front but diagonally so the rear right wheel goes to the front left the rear left wheel goes to the front right not too complicated i also felt that my brake pads were getting a bit tight um what happens is because Kathmandu's road is so dusty and dirty and rain and dust and grime collects on these brake pads and so sometimes you just need to send your car for like sanding the disc brakes and the brake pads uh, just to remove any form of like dust buildup on it and honestly that's it <laughs> that's what today servicing entailed and then three two hours i left there around 11 so two hours later i came out with a serviced ev car and a clean ev car <laughs> and my next one is again due from it's now at 43,000 and the next one is due at 47,000 basically so probably another three four months of driving it really depends on how much you travel if because my car runs about anywhere between 25 to like 50 60 kilometers a day it's usually within three months but if you drive less or more it could be earlier or later honestly anyway uh, that's just a quick summary of what my ev experiences are like drop a comment or leave a like if you liked this video see you on the next one